Hey guys, so I thought you'd like to see all my nail polishes because that's really what I like to collect and I like to have. So, um, I have around a little over 58 of them maybe, maybe 60. Um, I've gotten rid of a lot of them. I've given a lot to like family members that I think would like nail polishes. Like my sister likes nail polishes so I give her a lot also. So I just wanted to film a little collection haul of the ones that I already have and I hope you like this video. Okay, so this is underneath my bathroom sink. This is where all my nail polishes are. And they're in like a colored order, if you can tell. Like you can see like blues and like yellows, oranges, pinks, reds, purples, greens, blues, and there's glitter back here. And clears back there. And then like my nudes. So these are them. There are roughly a little under sixty probably. Um I had about 80 and then I got rid of a lot and like they're in bags to give to like my sister and stuff like that because she will appreciate them. So yeah, let's get started before this is super long video. Um, I have nail polish remover, like I always have a backup, so like I have one over here. See, it's like almost over, there's like a little bit left. And then I have another one. Okay, and then back here I got, this was like a score. This was nine. 95 if it will focus. No, it's not gonna focus. This was 9.95 and I got it for 1.99. And it came with a big light in here. It came with an OPI ink, this like a little one. And then what is this one? This is Rosy Future. It's just like a pinky color. And then I bought that at Ulta. And then I have this one, Loose Rentainly. Look marvelous, yodel me on myself, color so hot it burns, and then like the top coat that's like the fast one, rapid top coat. I'm gonna put all this back like so I don't lose it. And then, like, here's like the base coat that I use every day or like when I do my nails, and it's from Sally's, it's the Beauty Secrets one, it's like a really big one, it, like fits in my hand. And then this one came in like my chi iron, like you didn't see there's nothing left. This is kind of a crappy one, but it's just a chi um, base coat. Base coats aren't exciting, I'm not going to show you those. Um, I have a e.l.f. matte um, nail polish, and this is also from Sally's The Beauty Secrets. It's an oil and it makes like any top coat dry really, really fast. It smells like cherries also. So starting back here, I have like a little, like the stripe right that you can do like little lines and decorations with also from Sally's. I have an oily like French manicure color that's like a nude because I don't know I got this in a kit. And my like back row over here are glitters. So I have uh, the Katy Perry OPI in Last Friday Night. Oh no it's a Teenage Dream. I have two in Last Friday Night. This one is a brand that you can get at CVS and they're inexpensive. I think they're $1.99 and they're not bad. Like this one's kind of pretty. Um, it's just like pure, it's like a clear with like silver glitter. I wish my camera would focus, but no, it's not going to focus. But it just has glitter. And this is Tierra. And then I have Don't Judge Me, a Justin Bieber um, nail polish and the one that has like little hearts in it. So you can see that. This one is Step to the Beat of My Heart. And then I have a black from, I think it's NYC. No, it's Wet n Wild. And um, it was from the like, Halloween collection, so it's got recipes and it's got a big, like. Mm. Oh, that's not the correct shade. That's like for something else. Where's Grace White? Oh, it's over here. That sticker came off. That was this one. Okay. Next is like this gray from China. Um, from OPI of the Katy Perry and it's not like the movies. These you can get at Ulta. They're like 99 cents. Um, I just wanted to try a gray one time. And this is Movie Star. It's just like a gray. And then starting with blues, I have this Pure Ice, which I think, like, don't take me 100% sure, but <clears throat> I've had this nail polish for a long time. I think they're from Claire's, the Pure Ice ones. And this is Pure Ice whatever that is, Celestial, Celestial. This is Finger Paints and Add an Abstract. It's just like a glittery blue-green. 
Zoya's Yummy, which I use all the time. It, like, see, it like separates. You have to shake it really well for it to like, not look like that. But it's just a bright blue. This is China Glazes for Audrey, which is like the Tiffany blue. And this is Essie's Borrowed in Blue. Correct? Yeah, Borrowed in Blue. This is Zoya's Edita. And it's um, a dark green that has gold glitter in it. You can see the gold glitter, but when you put it on your nails, it's like emerald green with gold glitter. This one is Suvi from Zoya, and it's like just an emerald green. This one is Sean, and it's just that green that's showing up. Oops. This is Ivanka, and it's like, I always think of a mermaid. It's got gold glitter and like this light green. This is um, an e.l.f. polish, and it looks blue on my camera, but it's actually very green. It's like teal, and it's called teal blue, so, yeah. I don't know why it's in my green collection. It looks more green. This is OPI, uh, not OPI. This is um, Revlon's Minted, and it's just a light, light green. Purples! This is the Confetti, the brand, the um, same one that you get at CVS. And this one's in Smitten, and it's p purple, and it's got blue, um, like, shimmer in it. This is Zoya's Kiko, which I really like. I'm going to do my nails today, and I think I'm going to put this on my toes. It's very cute. This is um, OPI's Do You Lilac It. This I don't use very often. I'm not sure why I still use it. I uh, have it wet and wild, and it's like a mauve color, so I don't know. That's called Bite the Bullet. It's just like a mauve purple. And two reds. This is the see, CBS like tag. Like those two stupid like tags do not come off. But this is um, Masquerade Ball. And it's actually one of my like favorite colors to use like in the winter. I actually really like this one. And it's just like a dark burgundy red. This one is Valerie from Zoya. And it's just red with like gold and like pink glitter in it, like hardcore glitter. This I've had for so long it doesn't even have like um, like writing on the bottle anymore, but this is Revlon's Valentine. And it's just like a deep red. This is like my true red that I have. and um, Or like the classic red. I had this on my nails in, I don't know, I don't remember what video, but I had this on my nails. And this is called Expressionist Red, and it's from Finger Paints. My nose This is again from like the, uh, what is it, Essence brand from Ulta. It's like really cheap. And this is Ultimate Pink. Again, like another finger paint. This is, it's like a pinky orange. It's kind of like a coral. Oh, it is coral. It's called Coral Complement. Then... I have this e.l.f. nail polish that's called Bubblegum, I think. It's called Gum Pink. This is a Heart as Nails, and it's like shimmery iridescent pink, and it's called Fly Away. This is another Zoya brand. It's their summer collection for 2011, and this is Tango? Tang Tansy. This is Tansy. It's just orange with like yellow glitter. This is um, Bear If You Dare, and it's like a peachy orange kind of color with like yellow shimmer in it, and it's from China Glaze. This is from Avon, and this actually color like works really well. It's from their like Halloween stuff, and, um, and it's just orange, and um, it works really well. It dries really, really quick using it. This one is Lemonade Stand By Your Man from OPI. It's um, very, very, very shimmery. And I don't use this one very often. If I do, I use this on top of this orally because um, this color, it takes like five or six coats just to make it like opaque. And then this is Lemonade from Orally. It's just yellow. Oh, I'm getting done. This is Gray Suede from Revlon. My, nobody in my family likes this color on my nails because they say it looks like my nails have a disease, but I really like the color. 
And this is a Zoya that I got in my birch box. It's in jewels. It's like brown and has like gold glitter. It says OPI Sweetheart and it's just light pink. And then OPI Moon Over Mumbai. It's just like, it's kind of like a white kind of light color. It's kind of gray, white. And then I have this random thing that I don't ever use. That's a Sally Hansen's Quick, or Color Quick. And what color is this in? It's like, you can see it right there, it's purple, but I don't know if it has a color. Oh, it's called Pink Chrome. So, yeah. It's not pink at all, it's purple, but it's called Pink Chrome. So, yeah. That, the, that. Those are all of my nail polishes. And except for, like, I have a few that are missing from here. And I also am missing like my top coat that I use every single day because it fell in my closet behind a shoe rack and I have to like get everything out to find it. So those are all of them there. This is probably about like 50, I think there's 55 down here at this moment and then there's some in there. So I hope you liked my collection haul and it was really fun to do and to show you all the colors I have. I'm really still wanting a lot more. Uh, I'm really into blues right now, so I really want to get the Russian navy that's not the matte one. I want um, Dating a Royal because I really want that color blue. And I also want the um, OPI DS Magic, I think it is. That's like the blue that has like the cool glitter in it. I also want some from the Cirque du Soleil collection, and I also want some of the Crackles. And There's just so much. Like I will end up with 90 polishes by the end of the year. So I hope you like this video, and I'll see you next time. Bye! Also, if you have any suggestions to like nail polishes that I don't have and that I should try, um, leave a comment in the below because I'd really like to try new nail polishes that I haven't heard of and or like names that I haven't even thought about. So put a comment down below of nail polish that you, that, um, you think that I'd like or that you really like and you'd like to share. So tell me about it in the comments below and thanks. I'll see you later.